give us pitches. Um, yeah. I like to look for rainbows whenever there is rain and ponder on the beauty of an earthly queen again. I want my life to be as clean as earth right after rain. I want to be the best I can and live with God again. Very good, very good. You guys are good at following. Yeah. All right. Um, so, first off, um, I'm glad you guys, um, you're doing some things right, which is very, very good, and I'm excited about that. It makes my job a little bit easier. All right, so we're going to teach you how to purify and elongate vowels in English. I'm passing out this little vowel chart that I've written. Um, I've nicknamed it the, uh, the Jawa Transport. Um, is one of those an original? Can you tell? I think that was the original. Awesome. Yeah. Um, so, as we can see here, we have this sound. It looks, have you all seen Star Wars? Yeah, it's a little jolly. Um, it's supposed to model the shape of your mouth, actually. Um, but it looks so much like a Java transport, I just can't help it. Um, uh, this is the front of your mouth, and it, this represents the space in your mouth and where your tongue hump should be within your mouth right here. So when you're doing E, notice how I went in E, E, E. See how your tongue goes up close to your teeth? That's the point of where the, the, the large hump of your tongue would be. You won't, and here's like your, your teeth and your mouth and the lips, right? And this is where your tongue hump is, E. Now everyone say, Eh, 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 like as in a little bit. See how your tongue hump is still up there, just a little bit, but it's not as high as the e. E, eh, e, eh, e, eh. The tongue is only making a slight adjustment, right? So, um, what we're gonna do is we're gonna work together. Um, we're gonna fill out this chart, and we're gonna uh, have a bunch of unambiguous words to describe these sounds. I'll tell you the sound. And we're gonna come up with words, um, and you're gonna just gonna write the word that you think works and then I'm going to go through and I'm going to check just a little of them, um, correct any problems, um, and we're going to then uh, apply it to the music. Sound good? Perfect. So this first one, let's let's have suggestions. We, 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 it's the sound E. What, what's a word that you could use to remind yourself of this sound? E. Eeyore, as in Eeyore from Winnie the Pooh. That's a, that's a long word, but if it works for you, I don't even know how to spell Eeyore. <laughs> Um, beat. beat, yeah, like, like, I'm, I, ah, oh, beat, that's a good word. I want to write down the word that you think would fit. Um, e. the word that I like to use is P, like I'm going to take a little P. <laughs> All right, so the next one, um, eh. little, eh. le, little, or bit, or Egg. Any any of those words are appropriate. A word that you'll that would make the a sound for you. What's what's one that would work for you, Ryan? I'm trying to think of. You said the that one that came to mind after that, but should be a different one. It sound. How about you, Mike? Lit. Lit. I like it. Lit. <laughs> That's a good word. <laughs> so lit. All right. Um, the next one is a, as in say, or may, or may, like may I do this, or the month of May, makes an a, it's, it's not like an a, it's, it's not an e, it's an a, a. it's a brighter, it's forward, because it's at the top where your tongue needs to come forward, the way that the charts show, the 
this is the point where your tongue hump should be in the mouth. Like blades. Blades, yeah. Or pray. Pray is a good word. That's one I, I usually tend to try to remember. Pray or say. We all have a word? Perfect. Let's move on. So the next one is bet, as in bet or metal. Any other words? How about you, Chelsea? What word do you think of? Um, set. Set. Very good. How about you, Mike? Actually, I'm thinking regret. Regret. I like it. That's yeah. good. Mm -hmm. Yeah. Regret. All right. I think we're all pretty solid on that one. The sign for this sound is, there's, I like to think of just a, a, a capital E with the rounded edges. Um, lowercase e is the A. Eh. Now, this next one is one of my favorite sounds ever. Ah as in apple, or um, Adams, or hat. Can, can we think of any other words? <laughs> uh, so all the words that end in Write one down. Let's move on. This next one, um, the best word that I, I, I use to, to, to remember this one is father. It's an ah, but it's, it's more forward. It's not like like in the back of your throat, like father. No one says father. They say fa, ah, it's forward. The forward ah sound. Father or the bomb dot com. Bomb, com. Those are words, bomb.com. We don't say the bomb, the bomb, the bomb. That, that sounds silly. Like, I mean, if you're like from deep, deep, like King's English Britain, I don't even think they would say the bomb, the bomb, the bomb. So it's ah, it's forward, right? Now, this one on the other side, that lowercase a is an ah, like a, like a, like called. It is the, the back farther one. It's not like swallow, like gold, but it's it's still, you know, just nice and, and farther back, but it's not all the way back because as we can see, there's there's a little more space of where the hump can go, right? Um, or the absence of a hump can go, right? So, ah, as in call, another word, um, yawn. Yeah, lawn. Fond. All right, we all have a word. Now this next one is the one, um, the only word I'm gonna give you is God. Um, because lawn is forward, but when we pronounce God, we, we have this roundness to the sound, God, or song. It, it's farther back, and so it's that backwards A, is is the god vowel. All. All right. This next one is O. It's an open O. I can go O O O or like store store versus bow. Hear how there's a difference between bow O and O. There's a slight sound difference. And so the open O is the sign where it's literally just an O that has been made open. It's the circle that's open. And so store, more, bore, lore, a lot of O-R-E. Um, and that will be more important later if we continue this discussion. But for now, just know that it's, it's an open O. All right, the closed O the next one up it is like boat or moat, coat, float. Yes, these are all good. All rhymes that help us get the O sound. The next one up is O, uh, like look or book. Uh, uh, uh. It's an uh 
bus out. Book, book, suck, nook, book, 